this, Sean. We the only non-motorcycle in this parking lot. These people are extra white, which is never good. Well, you'll just have to be extra black then. You bet. These mittens are awfully restrictive. I'm afraid my hat used to be a raccoon. The fur is fake, Sean. What we should have done was waited to see if any more of those fancy brown ear muscles became available. Let's just get the information we need, drink some chilled moonshine, and bounce out of here. Hello. Hi, you must be the vodka consigliere. What the hell is this? What can you tell us about Devin Tilebeck? Don't talk about Devin in here. Why not? He owed a lot of money. What? That dude was loaded. <laughs> Look, he was a good guy, but he was starting to lose it. He kept going on about all of his dark secrets being exposed. First of all, thank you for being so forthcoming. It's refreshing. <laughs> what secrets do you mean? Nye venner, hello. Are you tilhenger of virkelig vodka? Hmm. Ova. This is my place. Oh, yes. <laughs> You're just the man we'd like to speak with. Question, do you have any more of those smoky topaz brown earmuffs? Uh, those are for our VIPs, and we're all out. <laughs> have you ever been to Norway? Just once, with my brother-in-law. We don't talk about that, Sean. Oh, but I'm going to be honest with you. Neither of us have heard of this joint, and I wasn't even aware this mountain existed. But we just opened last year. This is my second chapter. I used to run a different business. Successful and rewarding in its own way, but life has a way of giving you a new direction. <laughs> it does. Can I treat you to a favorite of mine from back home? Uh, is it Oreo flavored? It is not. It is cask-aged by my family in Fleckefjord for the last 120 years. Not to seem ungrateful, but do you have anything Russian? Gentlemen, Norwegian tradition. First, we look into each other's eyes. Mm. And we say, Skål kommer opp, gå til mor, til snakk om vår sorgen. Drakk i går, drikker i dag, drikker og i morgen. Skål! Cheers! And cheers! Kerosene. Tell me, who is the bearded Daryl Hanna over there? Well, that's Pei. He's my son. He's also clearly within earshot. He's already displeased with me and my career choices. Perhaps we all stop kirking at him. Fair enough. I guess we need to go. We do. But first, I need to go. This vodka went right through me. Thank you for your hospitality, Ova. We'll be back to wear these coats again, I can assure you. Can we reserve two pair of the extra plush russet brown earmuffs? Be sure to put you on the top of the list. with Greg Grunberg on an app called Jamaica Me Alloe. There are some bugs, and that's what caused me to photograph your hair. Oh, hairless genitals over there, twice. I will erase the photos immediately. <sighs> Bad news? I just tweeted that. You are one sick individual. Oh, 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 no. Don't retweet that! Don't retweet that! Damn it! You know, sometimes I really hate my followers. You know what we do with sick individuals? You give them the space and care they deserve? They get what they deserve, all right? What could I do? I pulled the man's finger. Let's go, let's go. Psst. It's nice meeting you, Oba. And you. Let's go! Hold it up. Dude, what the hell happened in there? I will tell you on my deathbed, Sean. We go on foot. What? Run, Sean! Den jävla idioten har tagit en bild av tissen min på dassen. Come on, dog! Dude, dude, motorcycle. Let's go. 
No, 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 I can't do it. You can't do what? Ride a motorcycle? In all the years I own one, how many times did you actually see me ride, Gus? I don't care. Sean, there's a bunch of angry Viking bikers coming this way now. Uh, Let's go. I promised Jules I wouldn't ride anymore, and I gotta be honest about something. Dude, now's not the time to try to suddenly live up to your vow. Let's go. That's fair. <laughs> That wasn't a hard right, Sean. I tried to tell you, man. What do we do now? I guess we just lay here for a while.